for me is more than an honour. It is the fulfilment, after so long, of a commitment to see good triumph over evil, light. and light over darkness. Behind me, you see unfurled the colours of the African National Congress. Black, green and gold. Those same colours fluttered behind me 35 years ago at Cliptown near Johannesburg on one of the proudest days of my life, when at the Congress of the People in June 1955, we adopted the Freedom Charter, which sets out, which sets out the vision of a new South Africa, a united, a non-racial and a democratic South Africa which belongs to all who live in it. For having this vision of a new South Africa Nelson Mandela and 155 other leaders were charged with treason in 1956. For seeking to make this vision a reality, Nelson Mandela served 27 years in the dungeons of apartheid. His, his courage and fortitude in prison inspired millions of ordinary people across the world into action against apartheid. <coughs> Today, as we celebrate the release of Nelson Mandela and his compatriots, we also celebrate, thank God, the independence of Namibia from over a century of colonialism and apartheid. The Nelson Mandela International Reception Committee initiated this historic event, above all, to provide a unique opportunity for Nelson Mandela himself to convey his message and that of the African National Congress to the world. Let all of us here in Wembley and all of you watching and listening across the world express our appreciation by committing ourselves anew to intensify our efforts until the evil of apartheid is completely destroyed. Friends and comrades, it's now my great privilege and honour to invite Nelson Mandela to address you. Trevor Huddleston has been a militant opponent of apartheid.